so this is our main page okay we will edit here so first of all we will do one thing we will just create two function home we can recall so the first function is first screen and then we will create a view in it with a text message so flex one justify center and align item center to center the text okay so here we will write text this is first screen now we will create another function so we will copy this function here and we will just change the name to second function second screen okay so so we will change it here second now we will go to the documentation so this is the documentation you just have to write on google tab navigation in react native so and we will have to install npm install react navigation bottom tab okay just copy from here and uh, paste here so i already installed this so i'm not gonna install again okay so after that we will go to the documentation again and uh, there are two things navigation container and create bottom nav tab navigator so f f we will just take this yeah so we will copy this and uh, we will paste this here and uh, then uh, copy this so we don't have to write just make it short yeah so this is our first screen just copy this and paste here second screen copy this and paste here and uh, first second okay this is just a name so we will call create bottom tab navigator so here it is and uh, navigation container here it is so we just have to delete extra words okay so and also in navigation container Okay, now just save your file and uh, here is your bottom navigation just click on this and you can see we can change the screens from here just by clicking on this is first screen this is second screen and uh, we will do another thing I just already created first second and third page from okay so we will go to the main page here and uh, then we just we have to uh, delete this and uh, we have to just call first and then we have to call second on a function and save this and here is the first screen here is the second screen I have okay so this is very very simple and uh, if you have any question just comment it and I will try to answer as soon as possible just follow this documentation you don't have to do anything just follow this documentation you can also 
customize your appearance from here you can add text you can add icons so thank you